Good morning. We have with us Joe Chang, CEO of NusaTrip.com. Joe, welcome to the program. Thank you. Good morning. How are you doing this morning? I'm good. I'm good. How are you, Johnny? Very good. Why don't you start by uh, introducing yourself? Tell us what, what your background is. Okay. Sure. Hi, um, I'm Joe. Just call me Joe. My background, I came from travel background. Um, I've been in the, in the industry since 1996. I used to work for a travel agency before and then Global TMC Airlines and then also on the other side as a customer. Then recently I just come back to the travel industry after uh, learning from FinTech and also e-commerce industry in Indonesia. And tell us about your company, Nusa Trip. What is it that you do? So Nusa Trip is the first online travel agent in Indonesia. The first that got the license from the airlines. Um, the company was established in 2013 and then still, um, still here. We are serving our clients and also distribution partners across the region from Asia, US to Europe. And uh, who is your target market? So our target market will be direct customers and also distribution partners across the region. Today, we have served some of them and then we are looking forward to serve more. And can you talk about uh, what you think that market size is like? So I think the travel industry in Asia itself is really interesting. Before the pandemic, uh, we are looking at international visitors between 208 million in 2018 and then to, in 2019, it grows to 360 million. After the pandemic, we see there's a lot of uh, enthusiasm for travelers to come back. Um, yeah, Indonesia itself, as an archipelago, we have about 17,000 plus islands. And then we have 277 million plus population, which is, that means about 47 of uh, Southeast Asia population. So let's talk about your competition a little bit. Uh, what are the other companies out there and uh, what are you doing differently? I think there are some players uh, who work like us uh, in the region. But then what we do, we provide low cost to full service airlines content and then we aggregate them. So we provide uh, this content to our customers directly and also to distribution partners uh, so they can easily access a good price across uh, the world. So, I mean, you're kind of touching on it here, but what's the, the real problem that you guys solve? So I think the real problem, uh, the post pandemic problem will be providing relevant solution because today the customer and the market the industry is not the same as before the pandemic so now the challenges will be finding the right solution and then finding the right target market and then really understand what other customer needs that's fascinating let's uh, zoom into your company a little bit uh, the management team talk about that who's on the board so we have some uh, peoples. Um, we have our management team comes from travel industry background. They come with uh, 10 and 20 years of experiences from sales, business development, operations, and also the finance. Now, what are some obstacles that you guys foresee in the next 12 to 18 months? And what are you doing about those? Um, this is a good question. The post pandemic travelers trend and behavior, that definitely something that we are looking or to solve. Uh, the world is not the same anymore after the pandemic. Um, yeah, what we need to do, we need to invest more in people because after the pandemic, uh, people left in the past and then we need to retrain people. We need to identify a new talents. And then also the technology has changed dramatically during the pandemic and then also during the marketing. During the pandemic, I think a lot of people forget uh, a lot of brands. Now we have to redo everything again, but then at the same time, it is a good opportunity because everyone has the same opportunity to race at the same speed. Joe, could you leave us with uh, some key takeaways that you want investors to know about your company? Um, yeah, sure. I think it is about time today to invest uh, because travelers coming back, the trend and the enthusiasm is there. We just need to do more. We need to do faster. We need to go bigger. So yeah, we look forward for more investment to the company. We need um, a lot of support and then to grow together. I think this is the time. Well, thank you, Joe Chang. It was a pleasure having you on the program. Thank you. Thank you for having me.